second game? I mean, well, how is the mindset different on this team after that victory at Central Washington? I mean, you just seem like such a different team. I mean, not just what you're doing physically, but it seems like your emotions are so more upbeat compared to, you know, the team, you know, that was on a 13-game losing streak. Things just started to click for us. We, I don't, we picked it up in practice. We've started to, you know, realize our way isn't always the right way and that sometimes we kind of do need to listen to coach, if that makes any sense. <laughs> um, but Yeah, I think the win in Central Washington definitely gave us some momentum coming home, and we were just hungry for another win. Uh, speaking of being hungry, uh, I noticed that your, you, your, your first three three-pointers all came at the, like more timely in the sense that they were making threats. I mean, I think each time they were like just down by six points. So talk about just what you were doing at that time to make sure that they didn't build on their threats. Oh yeah, um, we, we were definitely moving the ball better in the second half and uh, when the clock started winding down, um, I'd have a open look, so I took it. Sam, just talk about your game, another uh, double-double. Uh, quite frank, what's gotten into you? I mean, yeah. you're coming out, coming out party already. I mean, like I said earlier, things for me, from being a JUCO transfer, it took me a while to kind of adjust and to, for things to kind of click for me at the Division II level, but clearly they're starting to come together and starting to work the right way. Speaking of coming together, um, what you guys doing defensively is kind of stands out to me too. You guys seem to be uh, you know, quicker to the ball, especially like those 50-50 balls. Um, is that something that's carried over, just carried over from Central as well? Oh yeah, most definitely. I, I wouldn't even say this started the Central game. I'd actually say it started the NNU game, um, which was our previous game on Thursday where, I mean, if you could have been there, the energy coming off our bench, the defensive <coughs> stops, the offensive, you know, putbacks and, and rebounds and things like that, it was, that's really where everything just kind of came together and clicked for us. Cody, going to ask you this, but uh, tell me about the points in the paint in the first half. You guys had like 18 points in the paint. Yeah. Talk about that aspect of your game. Well, I... I kind of put a challenge to some of our inside game, and I, I really, we just been trying to run sets to get our kids as close to the basket as possible. So, you know, that's Sam and Taylor and Ruth and even Brianna. Just want to, we just want to make sure that we can take away the the inside. So if we can score inside, um, they're gonna have to stop us, and then it gives shooters better shots. So, but uh, yeah, we we've, we've been trying to get it inside. <laughs> How did you keep them composed at halftime, you know, even though you guys were up by 10 points? What did you tell them to make sure they did to keep the momentum going in the second half? Well, we were really just concerned about defense, I think, and I tried to emphasize that about, you know, we, we held them to 14 points. And, you know, they got, I think, 40 for the total, but defensively we were right on. And keeping that energy was alive, and, and that really helped, helped make them stop, get them good stops, made them feel more confident on the offensive end. So. Um, and I think the last thing I told them was just to smile and enjoy it because we just looked a little bit, um, a little bit scared for for a few minutes. But at halftime, they came out definitely with some energy and, and uh, got the win. Uh, Coach, when did you kind of see the the change in this team? Of course, you know the central win, but like in the practice afterwards, what what's really been the difference? I mean, these aren't the same names from like you no know, January, you know, I mean uh, December. Well, I haven't changed anything. I think that the team themselves, I think they've been a little bit more committed um, and, and we've been very strategic in practice. Like everything we work on is something we need to be better at in each game. And so, you know, fundamentally wise, we haven't changed much, but the, the, the direction in practice has been very, very pinpointed, whether it's just shooting the, the opponent, um, our own sets. So, so it's, I think, gave them more focus, more confidence. Um, and now they obviously see that it works or the little things that don't work. So they're coming together as a team. I think that's been the, the biggest change since then is that their chemistry together has been better. All right. I'm good. Thank you.